Today we got a drone's eye view of the race to protect a cracked hillside in the East Bay. It's threatening to give way onto more than a dozen homes right below it. So we first visited the Point Richmond neighborhood before Wednesday's storm. Wilson Walker went back and shows us how the fears are only growing with more rain on the way. This was last weekend's big storm. Someone walking this trail was sharp enough to notice the crack in the hillside and know that it was absolutely something that needed to be reported. Now, just about a week later, they have covered that break in the ground with a series of tarps hoping to protect it from the next storm. It's been working on it for quite a few days because in 20 mile an hour winds, it's hard to get it down. Pat Prindable lives right beside the evacuation zone. From his backyard, you can see the effort to protect a hillside that is designed to convey water. The water comes through from the hill and it funnels down to a freshwater pond across the street. Yeah, the pond was pretty empty before this week. The evacuated streets are now empty, except for the few homeowners who were allowed to grab more belongings before a more absolute stay out order came this afternoon. I guess some people decided to stay, and the fire department turned off their gas, so they had to get out. We are told by a spokesperson for the city that there are really two efforts underway on the hill. First, they are covering the problem area, and they are also installing instruments that should provide a better understanding of what's happening in the ground. Is it still moving? Is additional rain? worsening the problem. Well, when they know more about that, they'll be able to come up with some long-term plans, but for now, all they can do is hope that the short-term fix prevents any more problems in the days ahead. I'm not sure if it will or won't. I have an opinion on that. I hope it does. So how is the work going up there? Well, the engineering firm referred us to the HOA. The HOA has not returned our calls yet, but obviously this entire neighborhood watching the skies, waiting for the next storm, hoping the temporary job will hold for now. Yes. All right, and the slide risks and storm damage are keeping most inland parks in the East Bay Regional Parks District closed until further notice. So we checked out the Baronies open space across from Akalani's High School in Lafayette. You can actually see large strips of hillside have just slid away. Cattle also graze there, which makes the area particularly prone to erosion. 